So I know I look like shit and stuff. But, uh, and I know this is like not right for a video and stuff. But I mean, I mean, I really don't care. Because I feel like I need to talk. So I'm going to talk to you guys. So, um, let's talk about life. You know, let's talk about life. I'm in the bathroom, I've been taking a shower, and Hi, I just realized that, <coughs> I just realized a lot, I just came to a realization yeah. that I'm always talking about, I'm always telling my kids don't give up, and um, you never give up, and you always, even if you fall, you get back up, you always strive to be better than you were yesterday, and I realized that I'm being a hypocrite, I realized that everything I tell him, I'm not doing, right? I'm telling him, do this, do that, but am I doing it? No. I just want somebody, I don't care whoever watches this video, I just hope it can get into somebody's head. Like, don't give up for anything that you want. Work hard. Have You're going to have sleepless nights. You're going to have moments where you literally feel like you're at your lowest. Oh, no baby, don't do that. Where you feel like you're at your lowest point and you're just like you just wanna give up and you just wanna you just wanna be done with everything but no that's when you become the strongest. That's when when you're at the lowest point in your life, that's when you realize like I have to get up from this. Like I can't be this person. I can't let what happens to me or the situation define me and you shouldn't. You have to strive to be better. And I just realized like I wanted to go to the Marines. I wasn't able to do that. Right? Okay. So I decided not to. Well, I mean, I wasn't able because, you know, for situations. So then I wanted to, um, I wanted to, uh, be a cop. And I couldn't become a cop because of the situation. Which, I mean, I don't mind talking about them. I don't know if you guys really care for it. So, um, I guess I sort of, I didn't give up. But I just, like, lost interest. And, you know, like, I'm just like, uh, whatever, like. I lost interest in uh, trying to be better, so I got stuck with a shitty job, doing things that I don't like, and it just got tired, I just got tired of it, and I'm so tired of it already, like I'm ready to be better, I'm ready to become better, like don't think, I don't give up, like I really don't, like it's hard for me to give up, it's not like I gave up on my dream, I just sort of was like a little bit sad about it you know it was just like a little bit like uh, like nothing encouraged to do better but i looked at my son today and i looked at myself and everything i'm blessed for everything i have trust me like i'm thankful for everything i have but i do want more and that's not bad and i do want to be better and i do want to give my son everything i want to give him the best education i want to give him the best home i want to give him i want to give him everything like I really do and I'm just like I'm not gonna I'm not gonna give up I'm gonna strive to be better no matter what it takes I'm gonna accomplish my goals because nothing is impossible you can be the worst you can be at your lowest point you can be literally given up in life and trust me like it gets better like don't give up it gets better like it really does and I, I'm, I, I'm not religious, but I do believe in God. And I know with His guidance, I will become better. That's me. I don't I don't know if you believe in God. I know if you don't believe in God. I don't know. That's that's how everybody everybody's different. I'm not worried about that. What, baby? What, baby? But all I'm saying is that I believe in God. So I believe that with His strength, I can do better. I believe that if I keep trying and if I don't give up, Wait, baby. Take shirt off. No. Fine. Cause no, I believe like if I don't give up, and if I keep striving to be better, then I am gonna be better. Baby, give me one minute. So I mean, anybody that's sad, anybody that feels like they can't accomplish something, you're wrong. Like those are the thoughts that make you not become nothing. You gonna sit there and tell yourself today, like I'm gonna, you wanna be a cop? I'm gonna be a cop. If you want to go to the Marines, I'm going to go to the Marines. If you want to be a cook, I'm going to be a cook. If you want to be a freaking mechanic, I'm going to be a mechanic. And you're going to tell yourself that every day when you wake up, like today I'm going to do something that's going to get me closer to my goal. Today I'm going to do something. Every day, do something that gets you closer to your goal. Because time is priceless and time does not stop. And the more you waste time, 
the more you procrastinate, the more you put up excuses, the more you uh, find a reason not to try, it's as it's going to take you more time to get to where you want to be. So today, we're all going to remember where we want to be. No matter how hard our goal is, I'm going to be a cop. No matter how hard it takes. We're all gonna today. We're all Mama, gonna be closer to our step because today we're all gonna believe that we are. Mama, give me my tent. You know, no one, no one, no one, no one, no one, no one, stay in my bar. The bar, no. Okay, I look for it. It's over there in the floor. Okay, so yeah. So today we're all going to believe that we are going to become what we were meant to be. Regardless of what anybody says, regardless of an, any statistics, anything anybody tells you. If anybody tells what you you're not If anybody tells you you're not going to do it, cut them off. Cut them off today. I don't care if it's your mom, I don't care if it's your dog, I don't care if it's your cat, I don't care who it is. I don't care if it's your boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever. If they tell you you're not going to do it, cut them off today. Because we are done being filled with negative people that don't want nothing good for us. Let me tell you something. The people you surround yourself with is really does affect the way, really does affect you in a lot of ways. And it affects your progress and it affects a lot. So make sure the people you surround yourself with are positive people that are going to support you. And guess what? If you don't have nobody to support you, support yourself because you don't need nobody. I just want you to understand that anything you set your mind to, you will accomplish anything you want you're gonna get it so tell yourself that every day when you wake up today i'm like one step closer to my goal because i'm gonna do something that's gonna make me one step closer because i'm gonna do this now don't think just because today you tell yourself oh, i'm gonna do this don't think that <laughs> don't think that tomorrow you're gonna be done with you no it's gonna take time and don't if people are doing things before you don't worry about that because everybody has a different path everybody has trust me everybody's path is so different you can't compare yourself to other people. You can't. You can't be like, well, she's doing this. Well, he's doing that. Why am I here? No. Don't do that. Tell yourself, I'm going to do this. If it takes 10 years, it takes 10 years. If it takes 20 years, it takes 20 years. But today, I'm going to do something that's going to get me closer to my step, to my goal. I'm going to do something. I'm going to be somebody. Like, I'm not going to... I'm not going to get comfortable. Do not get comfortable. Strive to be better. But you're not here. Yes, baby. You don't got your hair. Strive to be better because nothing is impossible. And when you so, and when you tell yourself you're going to do this, and when you tell yourself you're going to do that, you're going to do it regardless of what the world says. Do not let nobody tell you you're not going to do it. When you're at rock bottom, don't get up. Don't give up. When you're at, be thankful you hit rock bottom because trust me, you're going to get up and trust me, you're going to be stronger and you're going to be wiser and you're going to learn and cut what we have to cut off, cut them off because they don't need to be in your life. They're going to be negative. And plus, you don't need to tell nobody what you're going to do. Do it for yourself. Don't do it for nobody. Do it for yourself. Don't do it to, oh, I'm going to show that person that I did it. No, don't do it for that. Do it for yourself. Show yourself that a day ago, an hour ago, a minute ago, you thought you were nothing. And then show yourself that, and then well, how, two months from now, a month from now, freaking three months, three years from now, when you finally did what you wanted to do, look at yourself and be like, yes, I did it. Like, I did it. I did it for me. I did it because at one moment I thought I was going to be nothing. But, to that, but that day, I decided to do something. I decided to accomplish a goal i decided to set a goal i decided to be somebody because i want to be somebody because i want to have a good home because i want to provide myself or my kids or my family with a better home because i want to provide myself with things that i want because i want to be better because i want to be somebody because i don't want to live this life and then just die and never be nothing no i don't want to live like that i want to be somebody i want to know that i did something so today we all believe that we're going to be whatever you want to be a, a freaking dancer. If you want to be a stripper, if you want whatever you want to be, whatever you want to be, know that you're going to be it. And don't get comfortable and don't settle. Just because you can't be this, do not settle. Do not settle. If you want to be a damn cop, you're going to be a damn cop. If you want to be a dancer, a professional dancer, you're going to be a professional dancer no matter how long it takes. And one more thing. If you don't, you have to be uncomfortable to 
you have to be uncomfortable to uh you have to be <laughs> so guys i get emotional you have to be uncomfortable to accomplish your goal because if you're comfortable you're not gonna accomplish nothing when you when you come out of your comfort zone and when you and when you feel uncomfortable when you feel that when you when you're scared when all those emotions get to you that's when you know you're doing something you know you're doing something that's out of your comfort zone so you know you're getting closer to your goal and don't and if you fall three thousand times you get up three thousand times i know i look horrible i know this is not a video i know i know but i just had to i had to just record because i had to get it on my chest and i had to remind myself like you're a boss ass bad word i can't say and you're going to be who you were meant to be. And you're going to accomplish everything. And you're going to sacrifice. You're going to sacrifice a lot. You're going to sacrifice your kid. Because you have a baby. And you're going to have to sacrifice him. You might not see him all the time. But you're going to be somebody. And you're not going to give up. And you're going to show him that no matter what happens. And no matter like the situation you get put into. like You're going to be somebody. And so today I looked at my little monkey and I realized that I'm going to be somebody. I don't care what anybody says. I don't care what anybody thinks. And I'm not looking for nobody's uh, solution. <laughs> I'm not looking for nobody's approval. I'm, I don't care. I'm going to do what I got to do to become who I was meant to be. I'm going to accomplish my goal. I'm going to set my goal, accomplish my goal. And every day I'm, I'm going to remind myself that I have to get closer to my goal. And I'm not going to settle. And I'm not going to get comfortable. When you get comfortable, you're done. Don't get comfortable. Be uncomfortable. T risk it. Sometimes you have to risk it all. Sometimes you have to risk it all. And there's this quote that I really do like. And it's just like a really nice quote. Let me tell you guys. Because I'm about to be. about to cut the video short. Because you know I'm getting emotional. And that's not cute. Just kidding. But no. Uh, I don't want to cry. So it's. I have it in my planner just to remind myself every day that I need to be better. So I saw it in the movie and it just got to me. So it was like, you know, the it was, it's like, you know, what's great about hitting rock bottom. And then like the little, it, I was, it was a kid's movie. And then it's like, so it's like, you know, what's great about hitting rock bottom. There's only one way left to go and that's up. And that's true. When you hit rock bottom, you can't go any, you can't be lower than where you are already. No, you go up. You strive to be better and empower yourself and surround yourself with people that are going to support you and bring you positivity. If somebody's going to bring you negativity, cut them off. You don't even have to tell them why you cut them off. Cut them off. When they are too old, they know what they did wrong. People know what they do wrong. People know what they people know what they do wrong. People know when they're going to be mean. People, everybody knows what we do. So if you get cut off, that's because you had it coming. So anyways, just strive to be better. Let's all believe in ourselves and Again, I'm so sorry, but <laughs> this is so bad. But I'm gonna post it because I feel uncomfortable, and I know that I want I want to do this. I want to do a YouTube channel, and I, I feel really uncomfortable doing. It. I feel really uncomfortable recording. I really do. But I'm gonna post this video because I want to feel uncomfortable. That feeling that I'm getting right now, I know it's gonna get me closer to my goal. No matter, even if I fell in YouTube, I don't care. I'm going to do it. I'm going to try because I need to try. I need to do it for myself. I need to show myself that I can do whatever I want to do. And no matter how hard it is, no matter how comfortable I feel, I'm going to do it because I'm going to do it because I'm a boss. So anyways, love you guys or anybody that feels lonely, that feels sad. Know that somebody love yourself. Don't need nobody. You don't need to tell somebody somebody loves you. No, love yourself. And when you love yourself, you don't need nobody else. When you finally love yourself and you accept yourself for how you are, for who you are, nobody's, anybody's, you don't need nobody's acceptance. You don't need nobody's approval. You don't look for nobody no more because you love yourself. And there is somebody out there that loves you. So, kisses.